The VolQuest Two Minute Drill is brought to you by Craven Wings. Alongside Tom Boggan, I'm Austin Price for the Craven Wings Two Minute Drill on this Thursday. Uh, however, you, you hear Josh Heupel talk. Clearly, uh, getting off to a, a quick start is is paramount. But also told his team, if it doesn't happen, it'll be okay. It's a 60 minute game. It is, and, and again, that's something that. Uh, he expressed to his team in Athens, Georgia, they wanted to start fast, but hey, don't panic if you don't start fast. Tennessee got the early field goal and then, you know, didn't play very well. So that's something he's continued to remind his team of. This has been a really good second quarter team. They've been a good first quarter team, much improved on in second quarter. You certainly want to start fast on the road. You want to silence the crowd noise. You don't want to give South Carolina any kind of hope. They jumped on this team 35 nothing last week. Missouri, or last year, Missouri what three weeks ago in Columbia, South Carolina, jumped yeah. out seventeen nothing and essentially ended the game. That's what Tennessee wants to do on Saturday. Orange helmets, staffs excited because the kids are excited, and and, and again, I, I think that you know always trying to keep things fresh and and get that little jolt of energy. No doubt, and, and Tennessee's calculating when they you know wear an alternative quote alternative uniform of some kind, um, and, and you know kids like this stuff. I, as I've told you guys, I mean. My son enjoyed wearing a black helmet his last three games of his high school career because it was different. It was something unique. They looked good. Um, this helmet looks good. I think everybody is very excited because they feel like the combination works really well together. Maybe some of the, maybe when they put the orange pants with them, it wasn't the right look. Yeah. But when they went with the all-white look, I think everybody really fell in love with this look. They're not going to wear it all the time. But again, you're always looking for something to, to captivate the kids if you need to. That's the world we live in, and I think the kids like this uniform, and so does Josh Heifel. Cedric Tillman, Omari Thomas, he was asked about those two players. He said they've been out there with them all week. You know, which, I mean, it's phrasing, right? I mean, I, I think we expect them both to play, but uh, at the same time, I mean, he didn't say, yeah, they're going to be out there. Well, Amari Thomas went back in the game yeah. after he got hurt. So I, I, I don't know that he's even on the injury report, so to speak. Yeah. You know, with Cedric Tillman, we'll see. I mean, I, I think he's going to play. I know he wants to play. I expect that he will play. Um, but, you know, that, that again, that is probably a game time deal. If he gets out there and he's in some pain or something, they may look at that. But right now, I think his plan and Tennessee's plan is for Cedric Tillman to be on the field. Biggest key defensively for Tennessee Saturday night's what? Just don't give up anything cheap. I, I think South Carolina has a hard time driving the length of the field, so don't give up chunk plays. Don't, don't give up a an jump end ball to the tight end. Yeah, or an end around pass, or you know what I'm saying. Keep your eyes where they're supposed to be because you're going to see flea flickers. You, you know, there's no telling what you may see from a trick standpoint on Saturday. So you just got to be aware of that. Don't give up anything you know cheap uh, with, with easy points to give South Carolina any confidence. Don't forget Craven Wings, all three locations. That's Chodo, Seymour, and Maryville. Get out and see them this weekend. It's a great time to pick up some food, go home, and w eat and watch the Vols play that game tomorrow, uh, Saturday night at 7 o'clock over there in Columbia. He is Oliver Olive, and I am Pete Millar for the Craven Wings. Two but I'm warm. When you're Craven Wings, it's got to be Craven Wings. Online at CravenWings.com.